Hey there, it's Jen from Something Turquoise and I have a super quick and useful design space trick to share with you today. Here we're making these darling iron-on totes and gauge bags, which I think are the perfect way to flaunt your newly engaged status. But as you might know, glitter doesn't iron over glitter. So let's get started. When you click this link in the post, it's going to actually take you right into design space. It's going to take a second to load up, and here we go. So we've got our totes engaged file, and this file is made up of three separate layers. So first I'm going to hit ungroup to be able to access all three layers. The first thing that I like to do is actually to color code my cut pieces with what um, glitter iron on or paper, whatever I'm going to be using. So you can go into the layers panel and select the different colors which is going to make it super easy for you when it comes to cutting. Then you know exactly which material to put in. Okay, so there we go. So I'm happy with that. And so I'm sure you've seen this little slice feature over here in the layers panel. And if you haven't, I'm going to show you exactly how to use it today. So we're going to select the totes engaged and we're going to select the ring. Now the thing is, is that since this G is covering the ring, we can't iron that on top of each other. But we want it to look like that. So by selecting and clicking slice, design space is going to cut that space out for you like a puzzle piece. So now we actually don't need this piece, so we can delete that, but we do want the G to be connected. So I'm going to click this layer and this layer and weld it. So now when I pull this away, you can see that the G, that spot for the G was perfectly sliced away from the ring base. And now when we go to iron, it's going to be like a puzzle piece putting the tote bag together, which is just so much, it makes your, uh, your design look like it's, the glitter is layered, but it really isn't, and you can use this technique with any design file. You don't have to do it with the G, you can move this over here, and you can do it with the T and the D and the E, or you can um, do it with just the E over here. You can really customize this. Um, design file any way that you'd like. So that's really all there is to the slice feature. I hope you've enjoyed this tip and I hope that you enjoy making your bag. Bye!